And now for something completely different. It's my first GoBot review. And I know you're probably saying, oh my god, GoBots, he's out of his mind. But I'll admit it, I actually like them because I actually had this one as a kid, as a toy. And um, this is actually an opening and a review of him. It's flip top. Um, technically, they did come before Transformers anyways. This figure's over 27 years old. So um, I'm going to open this guy up. He's sealed on the bubble right here. Didn't pay very much for him anyway, so... Plus it's Canadian, so it was even less than the American version one, so... Um, I'm going to open this guy up right now. I got my trusty knife right here. And I'm probably just going to slip the bottom. Or actually, I'll go to the side and it'll... Just kind of cut around. Don't want to cut up the thing too bad because he's got to hold it. And let's see if I have to... Uh, probably got to cut a little more. Jesus. I just cut my fucking finger out there. Sorry. Sorry for all the swearing. <laughs> Anyways. Ah, oh, yeah. He's out. He's free! It actually comes with a little... Could be a weapon, but it's actually his blade. But man, it's been forever since I had this guy. I don't know what I did with my original one. I have no idea. Hang on a second. So now he's out of the package here. Uh, better look at him. Here he is in the front, and in the back, he's got that cool blade on him, and it spins really nice. He's got two rockets, too, on the right and left that look nice. He actually is very sturdy for a GoBot. Die cast on the chest and on the shoulders right here. Those two posts right there. This is a Canadian package, so it's got some wording on it that it's all weird. And actually in French, and he's got a price tag of $5.55. It's Canadian money. Don't know how much that would be, but... That's how much he cost at Canadian Tires, places where I guess this guy was sold. So now I'm going to transform him for the first time. Hopefully it goes well. I'm going to leave the blade on there. I think I can transform him with the blade on. So I'm going to take his legs here and fold. Actually, I'm going to first fold. Okay, they snapped in place like that. And his feet snapped in place. Here's his other propeller. I'm going to, well, I'll push those in later, I guess. Oop, blade came off. Oh, his head does flip. Okay, so his head flips down. Hopefully that goes in like that. Well, that is really some tight joints for never, well, they've never been transformed, that's why I've done it. Okay, and the legs shoot in like that. This is just from what I remembered when I was eight. And that is it. All in all, it's a very, very nice looking toy. It looks really realistic, more than the Transformers did. Uh, except for like Whirl or somebody, like one of the deluxe Transformers from 85. But he looks really nice. Spins good. Whoop. Break him right now. But I'm glad I got him. It's cool. Okay, that wraps up Mr. Flip Top here. Something different on uh, GoBots. I like all 80s toys and this guy. I'm glad to reacquire. He's really cool. Nice looking figure. I uh, hope you liked the review and I will see you next time with something else.